Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Jenny here, the Uncrafty Crafter. I have another unboxing today from a diamond painting company. This is the first time I've purchased from them and it's Rose Profit Creations. So I'm super excited to get straight into this package. So let's see what we got. All right, you guys, look at this. International Fashion Uprising. Not sure what that means, but we have, look at this fancy box. I like the box. Colorful new upgrade drilling, new ecological cotton diamond painting. We have instructions on the back. And let's see. I really like it. The box is really nice. I like the box a lot. It's a little the box is a little bit squished, but I mean hello, it came from across the seas, right? So I'm going to open it straight away. I'm so excited. Okay. And the box isn't, there's nothing else in the box. So, let's see. I'm, I'm doing this outside. So, never mind the, like, coffee stain on the tablecloth on my patio table. <laughs> All the things, right? But we're doing it outside because I tried to do it inside. And the kiddos would not allow it. They would not be quiet, so we came outside. All right, so it comes in this plastic cover. And it looks really bright and vivid so far. Okay, Ooh, we have drills and a sheet and a toolkit. And I'm just gonna roll this backwards. It feels really nice. I really like the way this feels. Okay, so first, let's take a look at this toolkit. Let's take a looky, peeky, peeky, looky. Okay. So we get some tweezers. And these are the, sh well, these are actually different. These are kind of neat. Look at that. So they're kind of in between the sharp ones and the blunt ones. They're not super blunt, but they're also not poke your eyeball out short or sharp. So that's kind of cool. I'm going to have to hang on to these. I like that. I like that a lot. Let's see what else we have. All right. I think that's empty. So we have a white tray. We have an orange squishy. We have a drill pin with a regular um, multi-placer on there. We get a heart, not a heart, I'm sorry, a square shaped pad of wax there, and we get a couple of multi-placers. This one is a tin placer, and it's the thin one. Love the thin one. And this one looks like a four placer. Uh, doesn't say on there what it is, but I believe that's a four placer. All right. Nice. I'm excited about these tweezers. I'm super excited about those. Because I love, don't get me wrong, I love my blunt tweezers. I never keep my, I mean, I keep like one pair of the sharp ones handy. Only because we need them. But I'm also like scared of them. So, um, I tend to keep my one pair put away um, specifically to keep Jolie out of them. So, this is a square diamond painting. Here's the drills. I'll show you the diamond painting in just a second. The drills look really good. We'll look more at these here in just a few, few minutes. Okay, so are you guys ready to see this? Are you ready to see it? This is what I picked from Rose Profit Creations. This one is, I'm not sure what the name of it is. The name isn't on the sticker sheet, but look at her. I love her so much. I love anything Snow White. Um, and this is kind of like a, I don't know, she's kind of like a, um, pouty, 
sassy snow white this has 50 colors in it oh wow look at the ab's it looks like we've got one two three four ab's in this one and i like the sticker sheet so that i can like you know label my um containers so let's look at the image or look at the canvas since I've already rolled it backwards it should be good to go here we go you guys oof wow we I like her a lot I like her a lot okay we have Rose Prophet Creations logo here at the top and on each side we have our legend here on this side and on this side down here we have our thumbnail of the image and then we have our our um, information here so we have it's a 50 by 50 and it's square and this is called fairest by Hannah Lipsky so Hannah is an artist with Rose Prophet creations and this is an art piece by Hannah Lipsky so um, over here on this side we have the email address and the website roseprofitcreations.com so i love this image uh, the first thing i want to do is actually get down into the canvas and look at the symbols so we can kind of see what they look like let's do that real quick all right get up close and personal right so we have the symbols sorry for the loud noises um there's her eyes here's some of the darker symbols i like that they have the like white symbol in the dark background and vice versa you know that's always helpful a lot of color blocking in her hair all that dark symbol which is the symbol D which is let me look and see Ooh, okay the D symbol all of her hair Ooh, you guys can't even see what I'm doing Ooh, so all of her hair is mostly color blocking um, and all that's gonna be 939 so I like that look at her face she's just super like mm-hmm me call me snow white call me the fairest um we have a border i like this border around the edge i really like that um and then she's got these two little birds on each shoulder she's got her white ruffles around her dress and then she's holding apples i'm assuming it's a bowl of apples right her ruby red lips and her hair i just love her i love her a lot um talking more about the clarity of the symbols though let's look see they look pretty clear in the canvas so we never really know till we get right up in it with the i use a light pad so we'll see how that goes with the light pad now i'm just going to check out the plastic and the sticky i want to say too that it's um Kind of a soft back um i don't know it's just kind of got that soft feel it's not one of the scratchy like oil canvases uh and then we have scalloped and poked edges to help keep from fraying lots of traffic out on the road today <laughs> Okay, and then, oh, I like the plastic. The pl plastic is nice and thick. And it is very sticky. Love that. Love that a lot. Um, this is going to be one that I get kitted up really soon. Um, the small, I like the small size of it. Um, and I just really like uh, the image itself, so... A lot of color blocking sections, like I said, and then there's also quite a bit of confetti. You can see here, let me kind of prop down into the, like here we have some 
color blocking chunks, but then over here you see lots of confetti, which I like that. I like that like um, sort of like combination between confetti and color blocking. I like the like uh, a little bit of both, you know what I mean? Because whenever you get one, too much of one, then you're like, ugh, I'm bored. And then when you get too much of the other, the confetti, you're like, ugh, I need a little color blocking. So, um, I want to look at the ABs that are in this kit so we can see um, where those are going to go. I don't like to um, pull out all of the colors when they come bagged up like this. Um, just because, you know, it isn't super easy, but let's take a look at the ABs. Lots of pretty colors, though. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, it said we had four ABs, right? Is that what I said? So we have 47, which is this green AB. Let me So there's our green AB. See how pretty that is. And this AB is going to go Let's see, that is the green um, symbol, the like no symbol or the circle with the slash through it. And I see some here in this bird and in this bird. Yay! So those birds are gonna be a little blingy blinged up. Um, it looks like that's really it. I do see a handful up here, maybe a couple up here in her, in the greenery part of her hair. Um, and that looks like that's it, really. Okay, so that's the green. And then the, um, ooh, we have a brown AB, this one here. This one is the plus symbol. Let's see where that's gonna go. Um, where would that go? Okay, I see some here in the bird's feathers here. Just a couple here. I see some down in the shading of the apples here. Okay, so yeah, it's mostly just gonna be here in the bird's tail here, and then down here is some of the apple, the shading of the apple, and then um, just a few sprinkled out here and there and in here. So that's that for the brown one. Next, we have the red one. Pretty, it's kind of a pinkish red, right? I like that color a lot. That is the symbol F and that we will have some here in the apple, here in the apple. Um, we have some here in the bird's little beak and here in the bird's little beak. Um, We have some in these little sections here. Maybe a couple in there. Here and here in the berries. I'm trying to see if there's any in her lips. It looks like we might have a couple in her lips. Just sprinkled ever so slightly. Okay, and then the blue, pretty shade of blue. That one is symbol T, 
and that one is again going to be in the birds um and let me see t we will have some along the border in the background all the way around a little bit it looks like we've got some sprinkled out in here in the highlights of her hair we have quite a bit of it going around the outline of her hair here and through here so that's going to be cool um and it looks like up in here too in the shadow in the like highlighted um part of her hair so yay oh we have some down here in this in the um this little section part of the apple just here in the center just one or two there so this is super cool i'm super excited to work on this one um you guys please let me know what you think of this canvas so i'm excited um i would like to see real quick some of the quality of the drills i don't have a tray for me to put these in but they look it's hard for me to tell with that let's look at this one they kind of scooch there we go you see quality of the diamonds they look good pretty flat um not seeing any like trashy bits i thought i might have saw one with like a hole in it or something right here but it could have just been my imagination um but yeah these look pretty good so again it's hard to see these black ones but um i look pretty good all right so you guys that is it this one is again Ferris by Hannah Lipsky and you will find her at Rose Profit Creations I will be sure and leave that linked in the description box below um, so be sure to check that out um, you guys have an amazing rest of your day I hope you're doing well and um, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. And if you're new here, I'd love for you to subscribe and hit that notification bell to get notified the next time I upload another video. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.